So how do you move an idea forward? We all know that it's not enough to have a great idea. Ideas do change the world, but only if they're implemented effectively. Our healthcare problems in both this country and the developing world will not be solved by doing more of the same. What we're doing in the Healthcare Initiative is consistent with what Harvard Business School has always done. We want to train and educate leaders who will make a difference. Healthcare certainly needs leaders who will make a difference. It certainly needs innovators. My company is Vaxis Technologies, and we are working with a proprietary technology that allows us to create heat-stable vaccines. So Vaxis Technologies was actually an outgrowth from an HBS class called Commercializing Science. After the class was over, we decided to formally incorporate the business, license the technology, and that's allowed us to move the technology closer to making a positive impact on people's lives. So ultimately, founding a company like Vaxis requires a tremendous amount of resources and also access to information, experts, knowledge. The iLab provided all of those to Vaxis Technologies, which was key in getting us to where we are today. Well, the Healthcare Initiative is an umbrella over the many things at HBS in the area of healthcare. And it's an important umbrella. It's one that sits across everything we do in healthcare here at the school. It goes from MBA program to our alumni of the MBA program, executive education, the alumni of our executive programs, to our faculty and doctoral students. The challenges we faced over the years in running the Lagoon Hospitals has been providing quality health services and on the other hand, providing access to the widest population as possible. The Harvard Business School education has been extremely valuable to some of the other clinician managers who have also had the opportunity to go for the executive programs. Yeah, so what we are developing at Moderna we manufacture messenger RNA, so the patient will themselves make the protein that they are lacking to restore their health. So the partnership is actually one of the biggest deal ever done between a large pharmaceutical company and a biotech company. When I was building our strategy to get that deal to the finish line, I was using things I learned at HBS, like how to negotiate. And I think that's the power of HBS is you don't realize it, but slowly, day after day, they, they transform you. I've been a doctor since 2005 and have been working in the UK's National Health Service. I'm a joint degree student between Harvard Business School and Harvard Kennedy School. I think that the Kennedy School is fantastic at really giving you an idea of social policy broadly. Harvard Business School really, really adds value in being able to put those ideas into practice in a sustainable way. I came here because I had a passion for trying to change healthcare. Some people say that's naive, but I don't think anyone challenges the need for change. And I honestly believe that by being here, I'm really going to be able to have a much more powerful impact in the world.